It is Brittany Brammer again, and today I'm going to answer a question for you of my opinion on whether TSA agents should be armed or not. Um, personally, my stance on this is yes, they should be armed, but only a certain amount of them, and I will tell you why. Um, last Friday, according to LA Times, there was a shooting at LAX, which is the airport in Los Angeles. Um, the shooting apparently left one TSA agent dead and two injured. The shooter was reportedly angry with the government. Um, I didn't read too much further into the story, but I just thought this was a good example as to why we should have some TSA agents armed. Um, while you're flying, I don't know how many of you have flown. I've personally flown multiple times, and I think it would be really assuring to know that someone is in the airport walking around at all times ready to protect you from whatever could happen, like a shooting. Um, while there are police or while there are police officers and other people at the airport who may be armed, they're not in all parts of the airport, and there's definitely not as high a number as police officers in the airport as there are TSA agents. Um, I said that some TSA agents should be armed because having every single TSA agent armed is really not necessary. According to Stuart Verdery, who is a former Department of Homeland Security officer, said that it's not the TSA's job to protect the airport. Their job is to look for um, suspicious people flying, suspicious movement, anything that they could think is maybe going to harm people within the airport. But their specific job is to not actually do the protecting. Um, while we could do, or while we could give some TSA agents guns, we don't want to spend all of our time and money training them how to use a gun and gun safety. We should spend our time training them how to look for suspicious people. Um, I think that his statement is completely true, that it's not necessarily their job, but if you think about it, while you're going through security, you're in these long lines. You can't really, there's no space to move. If something were to happen, now I don't know where the shooting was in LA, within the airport specifically, but hypothetically, if the shooting was to be while you're in line or in one of those tight areas, you're going to want someone right there who's armed who could protect you if need be. There's nowhere to run in those little areas and those lines that are blocked off. You're surrounded by people. Um, I think having maybe one or two TSA agents within security limits would be a good number to have. Maybe one or two um, between different portals in the airport where you, that's where you wait to get on the plane. Um, I really think it just depends on probably the size of the airport, the percentages of um, incidents that happen at the airport that are violent. So while I think it's a good idea to have TSA agents armed, I don't necessarily think that they all should be. It's just not their job. It would spend a lot more money, first of all, to have every TSA agent armed. And I'm not talking about like a huge AK-47 gun. I'm talking about just like a little pistol, just for the um, knowing that every everyone who is traveling knowing that there is a little bit of something protecting them because we can't obviously take any of that in to protect ourselves. So I think it'd be helpful to have somebody there who could. Um, so that is my opinion on why I think TSA agents should be armed, although I do not think every single TSA agent should be armed.